into a deadly plant explosion in Wisconsin and the desperate search at this hour to find the missing. ABC's Lindsay Janice is on the scene tonight. Tonight, firefighters carefully sifting through a mountain of rubble at this Wisconsin corn mill, searching for two missing workers. A lot of fire, smoke, and a large explosion being heard. Part of the plant exploding around 11 o'clock last night, sparking a massive fire. There are several burned individuals. You're on scene visibly right now. I see five walking wounded. Crews rushing to rescue some of the 16 people inside. The fire was still active. You had fire departments that were trying to get to the uh, people that needed their assistance. At least one worker was killed and 14 others injured. The explosion rocking the tiny village of Cambria, 45 miles north of Madison, taking down power lines and leaving hundreds like Karen Detman in the dark. What did it sound like? A thunderstorm, but maybe 10 times as bad like a huge bolt of lightning that hit really close to us. David, six years ago, this mill was cited for multiple safety violations, but officials say those were fixed. Tonight, investigators here trying to figure out what caused this blast. David? Lindsay Jenis with us tonight. Thank you.